Well, they continued to count the votes on Thursday night for the U.S. presidential election. The NBA and the Players Association counted their own votes for when the next season should start. The NBA players representatives voted last night to support the plan of a new season starting on December 22nd for a 72 game season. Now there are still lots of decisions in the air including where the Raptors could play if there's still border restrictions or if the league will play in a bubble scenario. Well, we don't know when the exact start date will be for the upcoming NHL season. What former Ontario NHLer Kyle Quincy knows is that unlike hockey, cancer has no off season. Earlier this year, Kyle's young son Axel was diagnosed with a rare form of cancer just days before his first birthday. We went to uh, Children's Hospital of Colorado and uh, the day after his first birthday, he had um, his first brain surgery. So. Um, and that's kind of where the that's when our journey down this road started. The first surgery for Axel removed about one third of the tumor, and then he had a 22 and a half hour surgery on June 10th. The final phase of the treatment was 30 radiation treatments. He finished the last one on August 20th. So we were very excited to finally get to that end point of his treatment plan. Um, and the next phase in his treatment is to constantly monitor with MRIs and just his overall, you know, just paying attention to how he's behaving each day. Um, and he did have his most recent MRI about two weeks ago and it showed no sign of disease. So we were relieved and so grateful and thankful for that exciting news. More than 100 kids in North America are diagnosed with cancer every day. Kyle and Rachel launched the Team Axe Foundation with a mission to raise awareness and increase funding for pediatric cancer research. Our mi big mission with the, the foundation is to raise awareness and make people aware of this underfunding and to help us reallocate the funds so the children have more hope and, and better treatment options and new clinical trials to further, you know, save their lives. The proud parents of two little boys are also working with the NHL, who launched their 22nd annual Hockey Fights Cancer initiative this month. Personally, we've supported the Hockey Fights Cancer for you know Kyle's entire career and, and on. One of the things that we are working with the NHL right now is to bring awareness to pediatric cancer. So we're working with the NHL and we're very um, excited and happy that the NHL and the NHLPA are willing to work with us to help raise awareness for pediatric cancers. So far, the NHL has raised over $28 million for their Hockey Fights Cancer Initiative. As for Axel, today he's just excited to play with his new toy train. For City News in Toronto, I'm Lindsay Dunn.